Hey guys, welcome to my channel. Today we are taking a look at a Farrell's Ice Cream Parlor restaurant menu versus an Evans Ice Cream Parlor menu. Now, I recently acquired this Evans Ice Cream Parlor. I found it on eBay when I was searching for Farrell's Ice Cream Parlor items. And the, as you can see, the similarities are amazing. That they are basically the same artwork and uh, I'm a little confused as to which came first. Was Evans before Farrell's or Farrell's before Evans? That I am not sure. Or is, or is Evans a ripoff of the Farrell's design and artwork? Or did Farrell's get permission from Evans to use their artwork for their ice cream parlor? Now, if you look at the menu on the left, which is the Farrell's one, uh, it does say the original ice cream parlor restaurant, and down below, it also has a copyright of 1969. On the Evans menu, it has no copyright. Now, the Farrell's menu does have uh, food on their menu, and the Evans is strictly ice cream. However, originally, Farrell started off that way and was just ice cream, but later decided to add food to their menu. So if you happen to know anything about the Evans Ice Cream Parlor and how, why these are the same, I would love to know. Just put a comment in the bottom section below and uh, make sure you do subscribe. Hope to do some more Farrell's related um, videos in the future. So back to these menus. Um, if you look at the Farrell's menu, the man and actually the lady as well, they have more lines on their face and on the Evans menu, it is, uh, there, it's just more clear, not as many, there's a lot less lines on their face. So from this point, we're going to check out the insides of the menu and show you the difference there. Here you can see the Evans menu. As you can see, it's just ice cream. And uh, if you want to, you might want to pause the video and take a closer look at this menu. Here is the Farrell's menu. And as you can see, it's a much bigger menu. And that is because it also has food. So it has not only ice cream, but a food menu as well. So again, if you want to pause this, you can check this out. Don't know if you'll be able to read all this, but I did want to show it to you anyways. Okay, here's the main menu part of the Farrell's ice cream menu. As you can see, here is the ice cream. And then down below, which I'll show you briefly here, is the kitchen menu. Now the main thing I did want to compare on this is mainly the ice cream to compare it to the Evans menu. Now this particular menu is from the Scottsdale, Arizona Farrell's that no longer exists that I worked at for two and a half years. It was my first job. I laid the Evans menu on top of the Farrell's menu so that I can try and go back and forth to give you a little bit of an idea of the differences. Um, right here, if you look, you will see the black and white, and it is 75 cents. Now we're going to kind of go down here to the Evans menu, and there you find the black and white is 59 cents. Now, as you can see, the color of this menu, unless it was a different color, it could have aged more. And I believe that the Evans menu could actually be old. Well, if you look down here on the Evans menu, the girl dishes are Chris's Delight, Debbie's Dream, and Teresa's Salute. Now we're going to scroll back up here to the Farrell's menu right here. And these were the uh, names of Bob Farrell's daughters. We have Sharon's Dish, Christie's Delight, and Colleen's Salute. So very similar there. Um, there is a Clown Sunday on the Evans menu. For some reason, I do not see it on the Farrell's menu. But I do know that uh, they did. They had a lot of clown Sundays, and that was a big birthday thing. Um, on Farrell's, they do have the Farrell Zoo, and there is no such thing as the zoo on the other menu. So back to the Evans menu, you can see the hot fudge Sunday is forty-nine and fifty-nine cents. And then we'll go check out the Farrell's one and see what it costs. 
Okay, if you're looking now at back at the Farrell's menu here, you can see a hot fudge sundae and it's 75 cents at Farrell's. So there are a lot of similarities. Obviously, um, the printing and everything is basically identical. Uh, some of the items are the same. Pretty interesting. I'm just trying to find out more and thought it might be interest to anybody who's interested in Farrell's. Has anybody out there ever heard of Evans? I have not. Uh, my first thought was it was a fake and really wasn't interested in buying the menu. And then after thinking it over, I thought uh, maybe I would check it out. And so I did. Here are the Evans and Farrell's menu folded in half and put together just to show you how closely they do match up. You've got the uh, Evans one is on the left and the Farrell's one is on the right. Now I put them together the other way and you can see the Farrell's is on the left and the Evans is on the right. I hope you enjoyed this video. Make sure you like, comment, and subscribe and we'll see you next time.